Welcome to this tutorial where I'm going to be talking to you quickly about a common injury of the knee that we need to know about. And it is a very, very serious injury that is aptly named the unhappy triad. The unhappy triad is an injury that is usually the result of external force applied to the lateral surface of the knee such as from a hockey puck or an enraged debt collector. You may also hear the unhappy triad referred to as the terrible triad or the O'Donoghue's triad. And I'm just showing here that we've got lateral force and the lateral and uh, medial aspects of the knee. So as I just said, it's also called the terrible triad or the O'Donoghue's triad. The triad itself consists of three distinct tears of three structures within the knee, all simultaneously. So it's very, very serious. Okay, so let's have a look at what those three structures are. The first one we are going to have is our tibial collateral ligament, which is on the medial surface of our knee. Now, if we have a look down here on the drawing, I'll just write our tibial collateral ligament, and then I'll show you here. Okay, so it's on the medial surface here, or the medial aspect, and we've got this ligament, our tibial collateral ligament running there, and it's going to be injured along with the medial meniscus, which is going to be attached to our tibial collateral ligament. And this is why this uh, medial meniscus is usually included in the triad injury. The last one is our anterior cruciate ligament, which I'll just show here. That's our anterior cruciate ligament. And that's usually included in the injury because upon that uh, external or lateral force that we're going to have applied, the anterior ligament is quite taut during the extension, and usually our leg will be fully extended when we have that force applied. So we've got that anterior cruciate ligament there tearing, along with the medial meniscus and the tibial collateral ligament here. And all three of those will tear at once, resulting in that injury. So we have three tears all up, and usually we hear this injury referred to as the three C's. Now the three C's standing for collateral, cruciate, and cartilage. And this is something you really need to remember because lots of uh, examiners really like to test if you know the three C's. So uh, collateral, your tibial collateral, cruciate, your anterior cruciate ligament, and cartilage for the meniscus or the medial meniscus. So remember that. And once again, I'm going to write that down so you do not forget, okay? Remember. Now, another type of injury, or the last type of injury that we're going to discuss in this video that's common of the knee, is just an ACL tear by itself. As I said earlier, when your knee is fully extended or you're standing upright, the ACL is taut and quite tight, and if you are twist sharply on that, such as an athlete will do when they pivot, you can quite easily tear that ACL uh, just by itself from rotation force. So you have to remember that because of the design of the knee, it can support massive strain and weight through the vertical axis and can even absorb up to around seven times your own body weight. But when it comes to horizontal force, the knee is not designed to withstand it, resulting in these injuries. Okay guys, that covers the common injuries of the knee, including the unhappy triad and the uh, common ACL tear due to rotation. I hope this has been helpful to you, and as always, thanks for watching, and I will see you again soon.